Greetings, this is Lord Virgilus, and I welcome back to DKC2. Better know as Diddy's Conquest. So, last time we got through most of the first lo first world, and now we're topside trouble. Let's continue. Alright, so in this one, we also got another animal friend, which is Ratley. If anything, I say he pretty much feels like Spring Mario and Mario Galaxy, even though this game came out before Mario Galaxy. It's just one of those things that makes uh, a little sense, I'd say, because probably a lot of people play Mario Galaxy and not this, so... And his uh, super move is jumping super high, and he goes up and down and boing up here, and like, that's about it. Okay, let's find them. Let's destroy them all. Kind of like the rain level. There's like a snow level in the other one. First one, there's a rain level in this. Oh, but there's going to be so much more in this. So much more. Also, I do want to mention that the... I don't know, like I mentioned in the first one, that the graphics in the first one seemed a little bit more polished. In this one, it just seemed a little... they just seem... just slightly... I don't want to say bland, but I guess muddled? I don't know if you want to call that. I don't know if that's even like a correct term on just saying that. Like, it's there, but it's just not there at the same time. It's just not as striking. I don't know. Like, I don't want to... It's, it's, it's a great thing. It's a great game. And I don't want to actually, you know, rag on it. But it just doesn't seem... Damn it. Damn, 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 damn. Well, there's the end. Let's not forget the end. Now, I could actually get that by just, you know, getting hit. But anyway, moving on. Find the token. Let's not get hit by the dragonflies. Get the token. Yeah, there we are. Up to ten already. Holy cow. All right. Down the bananas. Bananas are your, your friend, definitely, in this, because they will give you definitely hints on where to go. Let's uh, try to kill this guy. There we go. Oh, I thought there was something under there, but I guess not. And there's the DK coin over here. Yes, bees are pretty much very similar to... Well, at least I'm gonna get Dixie. No, I can't get. Can't. Damn it. Okay. Anyway. Anyway, moving on. Apparently, I. Let's get the thing. We got Dixie with the guitar. Yes, absolutely fantastic. All right. I like her animation a little bit better at thing, and we also got Funky Kong, which is pretty much the same as the first one. Just move around the island. So we got Crow? Yes, I think Crow. To kind of, you know, go with the ones of... Okay, maybe not go up there right now, especially when he's trying to... Oh, yes. Okay. So yeah, you hit eggs at him. He'll do this thing where he you just get eggs. You gotta wait until an egg kind of just drops down and actually goes on the rigging area. And hit him with an egg. That's about it. Pretty simple boss. He's gonna do it again. And there you are. Done. Fantastic. I'd throw the big banana on his head, but there's no big banana in this, so... So, I'll try to get the coin to fall on his head a little bit. And if you go back, you'll see the world. If you actually finish it, you got an explanation mark, all the 
with all the bonus stages and all the DK coins, you'll get a DK coin in the world. So that is completed. So let's go with red, hot red pop. Which I do have to say, some of the lava levels in this are fantastic. All right, so that was a clobber. He will, they will get eventually annoying. They are, they come in different colors also. Different flavors, yes. Clap traps are also in this too. They're a lot more mean looking. So the clobber, the green clobber, you don't have to worry about. He'll just bash you around, basically. The other ones, which will come up, are a little bit more... will have effects to them. Clap traps are just insanely looking. They just look insanely mean in this. Instead of small, you got alligators are in lava. Beats me. Alligators and lava. Who knows? Who bloody well knows? Alright. As long as they help me. I'm cool with that. <laughs> I like how I get all the stars. It's like, oh! I haven't got the coin yet because you're. Alright, I want to get this. Those bananas. Alrighty. Now we got another friendly here we got squitter the spider and he has actually two moves he's got a fire web which can go on an arc down and an arc up and he's also got a which is uh, web platforms which come in very much handy we're getting up places so squitter pretty much you can go pretty much anywhere Except small places. Can't really go small places with them. Alright, so... Hmm, I wonder what the areas these bananas going. So with the with the, uh, the platforms, you pretty much shoot A, and then you press A to make it form. Alright, like this. And there's also ways you can actually just jump and make the platform be under you. But it takes a lot of skill and effort. And I really don't want to do pretty much that right now. So you do have to kind of have to watch the platforms. If they start to shake, they will start, they will, means that they're starting to disappear. All right, let's go here. I do have to say the shots do pretty much kill almost everything. And I totally messed up there because I didn't press A. Of course. All right, <laughs> let's do that again. Luckily, they don't send me somewhere too far away from the bonus stage so I can do the bonus stage again. Oh yes, mistakes will be made. There we go. So we almost got 15 creme coins, which is pretty good because I will be mentioning what creme coins will be in probably just a moment. And there is no good ones. So let's just get anything. I'll get that one banana, why not? Because one getting one, I like how it kind of echoes a little bit, it's great. Like, it, they put a lot of stuff into this, I have to say, so... Okay, so, going up here, we got Clubba. And Clubba is basically... Gar he guards the Lost World. And you gotta pay him Krem Coins to actually get through. So you gotta pay him 15 Krem Coins. And he's in pretty much every single world, starting from here. So you need to pay the toll to go in there. So and if you try to fight him, he'll just basically shoot you away. You have no chance. So I don't have 15. I can't go in the Lost World. I don't really want to go to the Lost World right now. I won't do Swanky right now because I don't need lives. But may I'll do it later on. Okay, so here we have a uh, Crystal Mine Shaft level, I guess. 
and I totally need to actually not do that. Okay, so let's try that again. So we go over to Dixie this time. Now Dixie has a move that she has with her hair, which is a kind of hover move. And you can hover back and forth, so it's kind of like a helicopter spin. All right, we're going to go over here to get the TK coin, which is interesting because it's actually in a bonus stage. So we got uh, Diddy and Dixie barrels, so we need to... And to get in the Diddy barrel, you can just shoot them in there, apparently. Yeah, I'll do that. Why not? There we go. Or you can just switch them, one or the other. Okay, so we have a cannon in this one. The giant cannon, which usually shoots barrels or cannonballs. Obviously, if he shoots barrels, you can jump on them. If he shoots cannonballs, uh, you have such luck. Alright, I need to kill this guy. There you go. Oh, let's get that K. I definitely like the music in this. And this gets into the debate of... Which game has the better music? And I do have to say that I don't really know. This one has a good share of music. That is awesome. But also, it's uh, number three has a good share of music. That's awesome also. Actually, all of the whole trilogy has great music. Alright, let's kill him and get hit. Why not? And he has a cannon, so we gotta watch out for him. And he shoots twice. When do you shoot twice, buddy? When do you shoot twice? Holy cow. Okay, I wasn't really expecting that. Okay, let's go here. And just like pretty much the first one I'm familiar with pretty much your main protagonist. Alright, let's... And I don't know why explosions kind of slow down things in this for some reason. Like, it doesn't really, like, frame rate slow them down, but slows them down. Or slows the surrounding area down. Okay, I've already did there. I don't need to go there. Like just like that part of music, it's just ran. There you go, kills him. Let's not get hit by this guy this time. Let's just kill him, and get it over with. Oh, I was right at the checkpoint too. Holy cow! So in this one, you'll definitely see a lot more different barrels, like this barrel that does different things, like it shoots you up. Actually, let's go here. There we are. Bing, boom. There's a bonus area over there. Which I can just go like that. Which you can use that bird to do there, but again, if you have double team, double team is pretty damn good. Get you places you don't really, can't really do with just one, one player. And there we are. 16! My foot's going to sleep again. Awesome. Oh yes, mini Nikki's with bandanas. And I did that even without actually looking. Alright, let's kill him before he shoots. I feel like I'm missing something. Okay. Hmm. Feel like I should go this way. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I should go that way, and I forgot the O. Damn it. Oh well. Oh well. Let's go this way. There we go. Well, probably jump on the barrel to jump on the guy to go on the bonus stage, but hell, you can use uh, Dixie's helicopter spin to. Uh, the same thing. There you go. 
Alrighty. We are going pretty good around here. Get the G, which is pointless. And this one here, you gotta go here to get it. And you gotta time that to actually get the life, but, you know, eh. Oh well. Alrighty, so we're gonna end off here. So next time we're gonna be doing Lava Lagoon on Donkey Kong Country 2. We'll see you then. This has been Lord Virgil saying farewell and good night. <laughs>